Hey everybody, Corey here from Power to Pro. We're here with one of our favorite testers, Al, who is going to take a shot on the, we're on a random par three using World Golf Tour on Olympia course in San Francisco using the SkyTrack launch monitor. Uh, that's right, World Golf Tour now has courses on the SkyTrack system, that's awesome. So we, we've got here, we've got the SkyTrack uh, connected Wi-Fi to the router and our iPad connected off to the router as well. Then the two of them connect over the router and we can still have an internet connection that way which is awesome which now we can use WGT and get all that information there. So from the iPad we're off to the receiver uh, via an Apple TV all wireless again from the receiver off to the projector and then project it onto the screen. So take her away, Al, anytime you're ready. We got a little bit of spin off of that one there, Al. How'd you feel that shot was there, Al? Oh, that was definitely a fade. So nice that the uh, SkyTrack there directly measures the ball spin, so it's uh, when you do fade the ball, it's it's right there for you. So we got 211 yards. Got a little bit of a wind, three to five miles per hour up to the left. And uh, what are you taking there, Al? I've got a uh, uh, three iron uh, utility. All hybrid. right, three iron hybrid. Okay. I can, I can hit it about 210 yards. We're set up for 200, but it's 14 feet up in the air. All right, let's see what you got. Not a very good shot. Well, we're short, short about 55 yards, so that, that actually only went about 150 there. <clears throat> well, was that accurate there, Al? To the shot that no, you it was accurate. The, the shot was not a good one on my part. Okay, just want to make sure that the readings are proper here. And as you may notice that uh, when you waggle, it does trigger the system, but it does come back. So uh, just for those of you who are watching there, that does happen. Great shot, right up there, four yards to the hole. Now this comes up automatically, so you can choose to either putt away or accept the strokes. Um, we're gonna choose putt away here and show you a putt. We got 11 feet, it's downhill 4.7 inches. Um, just a quick note for all you guys out there that uh, the balls on screen which tell you which way the uh, the slope is, we can change that to see the green speed and the slope and how everything's going that way. So kind of nice that you can switch that around and we're in the putting mode. So there we go. I'll take it away anytime you're ready there. It looks like it might be going a little right. I think you're correct. Oh, 
didn't register. So we lucked out there. <clears throat> So on the very rare occasion, it uh, may not register the swing, but uh, that's a very rare occasion from our testing so far. Oh, it's going right again. Consistent. Oh, that broke a lot. Let's try putting again. And the nice thing is you can also take a mulligan. We're just in the practice. When you do a random mode, it's uh, or a random three holes, uh, it's in the practice. Get in there. Oh, just shy. <laughs> And on a 2.4 foot, we'll uh, let Al just take a gimme. <laughs> All right. So there you go. And then your shots come up, uh, your scorecard comes up, and then it loads up to the next hole, and then the continue button will come up. So that's it. That's one hole on the WGT Golf using the SkyTrack launch monitor. Thank you so much, Al. For more information, you can always visit us at www.par2pro.com.